Hi, if you need to use split screen on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, let me show you how. So first, let's find the first application we want to use in a split view. For example, let it be Notes app. Let's create just a new note. And for another app, I'm going to select YouTube. Now, what we are going to do is we just need to drag this YouTube app on the top of the screen. And for the bottom, select Notes. And here is your split screen, so you can use YouTube and Notes at the same time, which is really useful. You can just watch videos and take immediately Notes in this application. Now, you can also tap this line here and reorder those apps. Also, if you tap the line, you will be able to change uh, the view of the applications. For example, you can make the Notes app as a floating window, which you can drag anywhere across the screen and remove if you just drag it to the bottom like that. Let's tap this line again. And here we can also change its visibility. Just drag the slider to make it almost invisible. Now also, we can close it and it will appear as this floating icon, which you can tap to open. If you use this arrow, it will just make it on a full screen and in that case you would need to make split screen again. And also you can select this icon and see this tab more detailed. Now, when it is in a split screen view, you can tap this line, select these many dots and change the application. For example, let's select the messages and now instead of notes, you have messages app. So, to close everything, you can just tap the line and close one app and then just remove it from Recents or you can remove it from Recents immediately. And also, you can open settings, go in the advanced features. Here, select the tab which is named Labs. And now you can see this full screen in split screen view. So it removes this top panel with time, notifications, battery percentage, and so on. If you want to do this, just simply enable it by tapping on the switcher. And now let's test it. So I'm just going to make this split screen once more. And now you cannot see here this top panel. So the application takes a full size of the screen. And that's it for today. I hope this video was helpful and thank you for watching.